fitness wise is everybody okay in between games yeah really good so we talked about Tom Davis uh, playing another 45 minutes on Tuesday afternoon, which we watched. So delighted for Tom. Um, other boys got valuable minutes in that game. Femi Sariki, Rhys Norrington Davis, um, Ryan One, Louis Marsh. So um, yeah, we're going along nicely. We're we're um, you know we have to, as we talked about in in length. Um, being healthy is really key for us this year and uh, everybody available for selection, which we have at the moment, apart from Anel, who's, who's suspended for the weekend. Tom, it's too early for him to be involved in the squad, but he gets a, 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 another chance to stick some valuable minutes under his belt on, on, on Tuesday in the under-21s. Then I'm, I'm imagining after the international break, he'll be available for selection, which is a, which is a big boost for us um, for, and for Tom. Because... Squad rotation in this early part of the season, I would imagine for you, has been has been massive, really. Not just with some of the injuries that you've had, but also with with suspensions and three dropping out with five yellow cards. Yeah, I've been delighted with with uh, with the attitude and the application and togetherness of, of of everybody. They respect the decisions made made, and they respect their teammates as well. Because you know, um, if we are going to have a decent season, it's it's always going to be um, the group that that has that. Um, season so um, players when they're left out they have to support and back the decision and most importantly support and back the players that are playing in that position that maybe they've they've had to vacate so it's really important um, everybody wants to play I want everybody to play I want difficult decisions to be made but uh, yeah no doubt this week there will be there will be changes um, in terms of the travelling we've got to do, in terms of the, the quality of the opposition and just the, the way the game is now, the intensity uh, uh, of it. And it isn't, as a, my old favourite is Liverpool, the 80s, you know, same team, same subs and 13, 14 players, you know, having a successful season. You know, you know teams picking up suspensions as, as we have done, picking up injuries. The game's more physical, more athletic, uh, more dynamic than it's ever been. Um, so um, we understand we're going to pick these little uh, bits and pieces up or we just change it round from from a physical point of view to freshen it up and, and as well to keep everybody involved as well. You know, um, they have to be um, um, tuned in. They have to be, they have to feel part of that group. And uh, I know it's not changes for changes sake, but we back the group um, and, and the players. Um, to come into the group when they have to, to come off the bench when they have to, to make an impact, and everybody's bang at it, and we have to be on on on, on Saturday. Yeah, their their home record is well, a bit like your own, really. Uh, how and why is that for Blackburn Rovers? You know, you don't turn up to games, away games, and um, and, and and have a change of uh, of, of attitude. Um, you know, every game's there to be won. Um, Obviously, home games with your supporters behind you. Um, Bramall Lane has been um, outstanding for us this season, but the feel of it has been really good as well. And um, so, the uh, advantage you get from uh, from being at home, a little bit more comfort in your own surroundings, and um, and from our point of view, twenty five thousand plus supporters uh, pushing us on and giving us that energy to uh, to uh, to to go and get the result that we're after. Um, and imagine from from uh, from Blackburn's Rovers' uh, point of view, it'd be exactly the same. Um, so um, yeah, they've they've done really well at home. They've had some some big results, and um, and we have to respect that. So ha yeah, how do you assess the threat that that they pose then tomorrow? Yeah, you know, uh, like like you know, everybody's got a plan for 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 everybody. It doesn't always work out, but they'll have a plan for us just as much as we've got a a, a plan for them. We want to bring our A game to the table, and um, I believe if we if we do, we'll we'll give ourselves a good opportunity going going and winning a game of football. But as I said, you've got to respect what they've got, the players that they've got. Um, got some good individuals, um, some talented players, good mix, um, some um, some experience in there as well with Danny Bat and uh, a couple of others. Um, Lewis Travis, we know a lot about as well, so. <clears throat> um, it's a it's a it's a team that's that's going well and um, been in and around the top of the table uh, uh, for the uh, for the early early knockings of the season. So you respect that, and uh, we have to be yet again, as we know, 
consistently good out of possession and um, and clinical in possession if we want to go and get that result that that, uh, that we all want. Um, 